we're talking, but this is raw. This, see, again, you remember, I'm record, I record people in history and get people's mind. I'm trying to, whatever. Okay, I have this announcement I have for a long time. You brought a battle of Algeria. Here's my question. What is the best, re the best, I would say, uh, accessible revolutionary film? Revolution film that, that you know about. Battle of Algiers, of course. Maybe Z, Burn. I don't know. What else? What, what you got? I mean, I like those. Are, I mean, I like or whatever. I mean, as far as, as real revolutionary films, I mean, uh, I mean, it's not a lot. I mean, you're talking about, uh, you know, major films, whether foreign or Hollywood, that you can I mean, see. Even low, low budget film. Yeah, yeah. When I say accessible, yeah. Narrative films, yeah, yeah. more so than well, documentaries. They, no, even documentaries. I don't care documentaries. But documentaries just, uh, uh, what do you call that? Reflective. They're journalists. You know what I mean? Yeah. Some visionary kind of things. Yeah. Like, Burn is a visionary kind of thing. Or, you know, telling the story. In the business, you know. But, of course, I mean, you know, in terms of Burn, you know, you, you know, you've got that whole thing uh, there. I mean, you know, very, you know, very, very uh, important on so many levels, and one that you don't see on a regular basis. Mm -hmm. You know, you got that. You know, Battle of Algiers has always been one of my favorites. You know, it's really uh, an important movie. Yeah, I got the whole box with the, well, everybody, every Saeed talking all that stuff. Excuse okay. me. That's the, okay. uh, the what the Criterion. Uh, yeah, yeah. The um, Criterion I, yeah, edition. I, I wish I now, now, and now I do want money. Because I would go down to Criteria and I say, "Okay, I got me twenty-five thousand dollars. Give me the everything. Give me, give me the, some Kurosawa. Give me some da, 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 everything. Da, 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 da. Everything. Okay, here's the thing. You ready for this? This revolutionary film was the story comes from a white woman, uh, 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 English white woman, directed directed by directed by a, uh, a uh, famous director, whatever. I guess he's stuck England too, but he's known as an American, whatever, like that, like that." You ready for it? Well, let me give you yours first because this is going to blow your socks away. Which one, which one do you think about? Quilombo. Oh, yeah, Quilombo. Yeah, surely, surely, surely. Quilombo. That's, yes. that's a favorite. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's, okay. That's good. Alfred Hitchcock's The Birds. <laughs> <laughs> Alfred I know Hitchcock's the, the I know Birds. The, I know the movie. Okay, I know the movie here we go. Well. Hold on to your seats. I insist this is the most accessible and true uh, black revolutionary film. Okay, what do, we, what do we have? The first thing we have, we have the, uh, the, 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 the lovebirds in the cage. A woman takes this, you know, wants these birds, right? And she brings it over. She's just, but it's the woman, it's the one, right? As they're going over to the island, she's the attack. Not but lovebirds are lovebirds. But no, there's some other birds coming to attack. Why are you talking? Okay, fine. They're still in the cage. Right. Slaves in the cage. Right? Okay. They're brought over to the island, whatever, you know, just got the house there. And then all the stuff started happening. They say, hey, you know, we don't like this. We gotta get off our island. We don't like to do What do they do? They they attack kids, they get killed, start fire, they just and they they gotta get out of there. You know what I mean? Then, but here's the most revolutionary part. And of course, you know, we got all the crows, the blackbirds, you know, that, that, that's why we get the, the, the hardcore, whatever happens. But what happens at the end? What happens is they allow the white couple to leave peacefully. And this is the turn. This is what I'm saying. The thing that white people, whoever, the forces that be, are afraid of that we might do the same thing that they do to us. And this film, to me, is a perfect, it's almost like a perfect thing about how a revolution is supposed to happen and how you're supposed to end, end it, you know, subside it. That's why I, I say this is the most accessible uh, rev film on revolution pertaining to black people, especially in the old, we went through chattel slavery. Imaginable. Thank you very much. <laughs> now... Do you think that uh, Hitchcock and I, I don't remember who actually, you know, did the writing on it, had, you know, some idea in regards to, uh, you know, saying, you know, that this was essentially a parable? No, 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 no. Okay, let me get... Let me. And I'm not saying that it would be as you stated it. I'm just saying in terms of the vision that Hitchcock and the screenwriters had. Well, no, I haven't had the kind of conversation with anybody that's filmed them. Maybe I should. But, you know, maybe he might have had a thing. You know what I mean? He's just, telling, he's just telling the story. He's telling the spectacular. It's supposed to have been a horror film when it came out or whatever it is. My point is, it's art. In other words, when you put a... Uh, not, not Picasso, but you, you, you put a reardon on the wall, 
you see one thing, I see another thing. Reed said, hey, I don't know where y'all coming from. This is just about, you know, you know, uh, uh, you know, my wife left some scrambled eggs out and I just decided to, and this, is, you know, this comes, but when you interpret it, you're gonna look at it a certain way. I'm gonna look at it a certain way. It suits my revolutionary senses, if you were, sensibilities, to say that The Birds is a revolutionary film. Okay. Believe me, there's a bunch of people saying, you are absolutely, actually, man, this is okay. not a revolutionary film about black revolution in the United States, how would they? A lot of people, gonna, most people are going to say that. Well, but you know, people you saw, me. yeah, you know, you saw, you know, something and, and you were able to interpret it in that particular way. Which is, and it inspires, which is cool. it, it can inspire me. All right. Just like any painting or any sculpture can inspire me, you know? I just took a picture, put up on my Instagram uh, down there, you know, Frederick Douglass Circle, whatever it is, mm -hmm. that statue there. And what I did, I, I did his, I did his feet first. Okay. You know? Then it come with another side angle. Unfortunately, I cut the I cut the top of his hair off a little bit. I'm sorry, you know, I, I don't know what I was thinking. And so I put it in, but then I said, you know, um, uh, the, these shoes, who can fill these shoes? Can anyone fill these shoes? So when I look at that statue, every, every, people say, this is it. I look at the statue as, no, look how big those shoes are. Who, who can do this in this day and age? Who can do this? That kind of thing. So when are you going back to South Africa? I spoke to you on a plane on Wednesday. Now my little thing is I have to get. You mean it. two days after today? No, no, no. The, next the week, following week. Next, next week. Next, next week Wednesday. All which right. makes me very happy. Now I'm I, sure. I went down to the VA and got all my medicine for three months. And okay. Whatever, and all of us all right. that's, that's where I walked down there today. I got you. But also now my only issue now I got to figure this out. But I'm going to try to get a, a, a. I need a rapid COVID test. Uh -huh. In other words, COVID, they take yeah. 48 to 72 hours, but there's a rapid one. Yeah, there's a rapid one. That can, that can, you, you can do, like, whatever. Right. Because the plane, I think that their thing is, like, 48 hours, within 40 years, you have this mm -hmm. test, whatever. So I gotta, I've got to, I'm about to send my, a note to my, my physician, whatever, have it. Because I probably can go there through the emergency room, get the test done on Tuesday, mm -hmm. and that'll be good for leaving for Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, you just have to see who's got, because, you know, you got rapid that are, you know, Ready within 15 minutes. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They, they have it at the VA. But okay. You, but you have to get, but they, they, will, they have to go to the emergency room. Okay. Right? And then it has to be, you know, your, your doctor's got to, you know, my primary physician's got to sign off okay. for it. You know? So I mean, I'm, I'm writing a note today, you know. I, yeah, well, if you got to travel and you need it. Yeah, I'm going to say, hey, well, I'm going to say, look, doc, you know I ain't been there in a year. Now, you are you going to actually tell me that I can't talk, to, I can't be with my wife no more? Oh, we're gonna have problems. Oh, you think you think you have post-traumatic stress syndrome with all these other patients you got? This is gonna be some post-stress that you ain't never time. seen in your life. How long you been here now? A year. But it's interesting because a year. Because you got here time. before everything, then. So well, as it was happening, I left last in March. March. As wow. it was, they, they locked they locked down in fact what happened this, the, the, the embassy had my passport they was doing some stuff they locked down and my passport was stuck in the embassy for a month I was in, they mailed it to me in St. Louis wow. to get my passport back wow. but, but here's the thing the year was necessary because remember then last May my, 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 my older brother died there's a bunch of stuff that happened this year I even got oh do you know about this oh man Oh, man, you should know about this. You know, there's going to, I think they, they made a law, and in September, no, October, you have to have, to apply domestically, you have to have what's called a real ID. And it's a regular driver's license, but notice, see, they got the star. Mm -hmm. You got to have that to drive, otherwise, there's going to be some old. Well, I can fly with a passport. Well, no, no, we're talking about domestically. Yeah, but I mean, I could fly with a passport domestically. Okay. I think, I hope. I, I hope so, too, but, you know, I, I, I was... Because you went and got one of them. Hey, because it was easy. I mean, I was, I'm going to say, okay, I'll get it. You know, because I got a passport, yeah, but, see, I know, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, <laughs> and I have the, I have a passport card also. Oh. Passport. So maybe I can use that, because I've got the passport... And you, you had the option to go ahead, yeah, to get a passport card. They have a, you have a picture on it? Yeah. Oh, really? I never heard about that. Yeah. They give you a, a, a passport. You could get a passport and a passport card. I think the passport card should be good as being like real ID. So, I mean, my thing was, 
you know, well, you needed to get into uh, federal buildings or whatever. Yeah, 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 and I right. said, well, listen, I can get if I got to go to a federal building, I can take my passport or yeah. my passport card. But that's why I just didn't remember. That's why they did this field ID is about the federal buildings to make it easier. Yeah. I didn't know how to pass yeah. because yeah. what I so used VA to, you need. Do you need real ID now? Or? No, no, VA. You still use your VA uh, thing. Okay. You still use your. I don't. In fact, I don't know. Maybe they might change it, but you yeah. still your VA should be your VA. Because it's theoretically be. a federal building. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's why right. I that's, asked. That's true. Yeah. But the other, the, uh, I think the other uh, problem with not, not with that, not problem, but what I used to do, uh, you have my passport, right? What I would do is I would color zip, color copy it, right? And I fuck, I still do it when I have my thing right now. And then, which would have, which would, is not for any legal things, but if I lost my passport, I would have some sort of, so I think that that's right. what this passport ID is about just to make it easier, you know, if you lose your passport, then you can blah, 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 I, I guess. I'm sure. Yeah, I, I haven't done that. Uh, I think I had the option the last time I had my license, and I was like, I didn't, just didn't want to go through it. Just, I said, just, just send me my license, man. You know, I got my passport, I got my this, I got my that, I got my blah, 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 my blue, blue, blue. That's the I need. Help what? Is that good? We need to do some things from South Africa. Now that we got all this Zoom stuff, you know, we, we're kind of set up. You know, see what you can do on your end. You know, see what you got in terms of, uh, you know, internet takes, access. That's takes, the point. It takes money. Some money because the internet. Remember, we're in South Africa, man. Phone calls, internet, of course, because America, a lot of things. Like, there was a thing where uh, telephone, right? You, you know you know how you, uh, uh, they're ripping you off with these prison phone lines or whatever have you? Yeah. Well. It was like that. Well, just like that in South Africa, they rip you off. And meanwhile, that same phone company is is, is, is is you're having like say Detroit has a the cheap cheaper phones. Well, that's because you're subsidized by the, what they're doing over here. Yeah, yeah. You know. Now I uh, I talked to the last time I had uh, people on from South Africa. I had uh, Zenzli Zenzli Hoysan on and had called him, I believe, using a uh, phone card. Yeah. Which I mean, you know, at this particular point, it's like. I guess, you know, some people from the Caribbean and Africa still yeah. use that. Yeah. But uh, that's what I used. But, you know, the thing would be, you know, if you can get an internet connection. And, I yeah, mean, for you, us, you it's so, WhatsApp. like... You, you can do a WhatsApp connection. You can do a... Maybe do a, a Google FaceTime or Zoom or whatever. FaceTime. Just, 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 the technology keeps on changing. I mean, yeah, I don't yeah. even know what... What, what, what's going on? Uh, what's Apple? You know, you could use uh, just your cellular data. I mean, you don't have to use internet yeah, but, per se but, or Wi-Fi or anything like that. Yeah, but you, it's still going to cost. You know what I mean? It costs tremendous. Wow. Like when I to talk to my wife, I told me I, I use WhatsApp. You know, you're not, you know, like that. Yeah. So I mean, you can FaceTime too. And that, well, I you mean, can, you know, that should be free, kind of end to end in terms of what's that, right? Yeah, yeah. Well, it's, it's it's a little something, but it's not it's not nothing that you 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 notice. Let's put it that right, way. Right. Okay. But yeah. my whole thing is you get lot, uh, my have a whole thing about Wi-Fi. We told you about that and all the rest. Of it. And it should be all the static nations should have. So basically, all the static nations should get together, and basically, it's free internet for if you're in that in that area. Done. Should, should be. You get free internet, then you can talk to anybody at any place. Well, you know that's that's where we have to move. You know that that's uh, something, and that that should be. Uh, you know, an international call, especially after the pandemic, you know, I say after. But even I'm saying, the, 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 that's my point. You got to get down into the thing. The, is you have to do Wi-Fi. In other words, it's not Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi is, is radio waves. Wi-Fi is light waves. Okay. Faster, cheaper. Right. But people, but, but the powers that be, they don't want all this stuff like that. If you get, oh, no, they don't want that. So now I'm not in position. I'm no whatever. To, 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 to make them do something. Just like I give you a better thing, say energy. Everybody's talking wind and solar. Yeah, 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 yeah. South, Southern Africa has this thing. They have two oceans. You know, the Indian Ocean and Atlantic Ocean. Well, there's a thing called wave power. If you can, you can basically have a barrier weave for just wave power, and you can have your energy up in your zoo. You got all kinds of stuff, but they won't do it because it's not in their interest, and you have to get somebody a different. On both the East River and the West River, uh, West River, the Hudson River, they have uh, underneath. They've got you know some, I guess almost like. Um, it captures energy. Yeah, it, it's. Um, 
I guess it's almost like windmills, but they're water, you know, I guess you can call them a water mill or whatever else yep. it is, you know. So they've got a couple of little farms that they were experimenting with That's right. on both sides. Now, of course, you know, that, and then the other thing is that you got to exploit you got to exploit the sun. You know, we're exploiting the sun, getting our vitamin D, man, feeling good, man. It's like, hey. And, uh, you know, helping us. Yeah. As far as, you know, virus, et cetera, anything else, man. Well, that's Strengthening our immune system. There's so many, so many other things, not just wind and solar and wave power. There's this whole, you know, uh, geo Geothermal, whatever yeah, whatever the yep, heck yep, is, you know yep, I mean? yep, yep, yep. I mean, for goodness but, sake. But, uh, you know, in terms of, no, I'm, I'm just saying, in terms of electrical en- energy, you know, and this is something that you, you're seeing that was happening in places like Kenya and Tanzania. Is that people were going ahead, and you know, in places that were like outlying, yeah, taking this, they were getting little solar connections or whatever that could essentially provide electricity for their little homes. That's man. right. You're supposed you know? to do it. Yeah, I'm yeah, sure that. yeah. You're it needs to be done, it, it, and it's uh, look, you know. Talking about crazy Bill Maher, he's talking about he's been trying to get solar on his house for, I know, like two years, man. Really? You know, I had solar on my house two years ago. Well, <laughs> well, he is that I don't know what's wrong with him. Yeah, he's retarded or something like that. Yeah, you know, I don't know what's wrong with him. But, you know, I mean, the point is, is that, you know, I did it. It was a program where it was like no cost to me in regards to going ahead and getting everything hooked up and installed. And then it's just as opposed to purchasing it, which would have been expensive. You know, it would have been like probably about forty thousand dollars that I would have wow. taken the loan out to. to go I just told him Jake he has solo on his on his on his thing. He says it's something like twelve cents, <laughs> not twelve cents, like twelve dollars for the month. Some of some yeah, crazy yeah, thing like yeah, that. Yeah, you know I mean? yeah. I mean, in terms of uh, electricity like that, I just have to normally I only pay for the kind of connection fees. And as a matter of fact, in some instances. I'm providing electrical power to the grid. That's right. That's what's supposed to happen. Yeah. That's yeah. supposed to happen. But so. I was also talking to Grayson about something. It's interesting. Africa is so interesting. This is why this is why you talk about Pan Africa and AU. This is this is what people should be looking at. You know, the Chinese have this thing where it's like a they strat they can straddle a highway. And the transport is over the high, straddling the highway, right? And then so your your public public people are up there in that thing. Then when you get to a station, you just get off like that. Okay, great. Well, you can have high speed rail like that. You have to put it up in the air. And you know, and the thing so is, Africa down, has the right. space to do that. You yeah. see? Well, you know, I mean, the interesting thing is. Uh, it's going to have to be at this particular point probably Asians who are going to have to help in regards to the construction of that. Well, they always have. It didn't yeah. the Asians? The Asians a long time ago. I remember back in the Tanzam 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 Railroad. No, the, where, where was it? A Zambia because it's landlocked. They wanted. They had. They had the Asians were building a rail thing. Tanzam. Okay. That's what I'm saying. The Tanzam okay. Railroad. The Chinese were going ahead and building, uh, you know, building a uh, railroad, stopped. huh? Why did that just stop? I think it, it. I think they did it. I mean, I don't know oh, okay. what, what the status of it is now, but it was the Tanzania Railroad between Tanzania and Zambia. Yeah, yeah. The Chinese were doing that back in the seventies. Yeah, that's you know, right. So but they, you know, the, the irony, of course, of all of this is that here it is the United States. They can't build high speed rail or any kind of shit. I mean, it's just ridiculous. You know, here it is like, you know, you rode Amtrak, you know, the shit goes too fast, it'll fall off the track like yeah. Lionel trains when yeah. you were like a, yeah. little, like a yeah. kid and stuff, you know. And, you know, you want to criticize, you don't want to talk about the Chinese Communist Party or, you know, you want to go ahead and beat up Asians. Man. You know, it's just... You know, I tend to just... Look. And thinking about the Asians for a minute, I was talking to some folks over the weekend. And they had the same kind of stereotypical views of Asians that the white folks had. They were like, oh, the Koreans are really exploiting, you know, they weren't even saying Koreans. Asians are exploiting us in our community. So I don't know if I can really get with defending them. People don't, like people don't travel. I remember I was, where was I? I was in, uh, I was in uh, Nepal, right? And the guy says to me, he said, oh, we, we, uh, we Nepalese, we're just like the Indians. We're just kinder. <laughs> and he was right. 
they're just nicer. The, 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 the Indian, Indian Indians are just what they are, but they, the, the, the police are just, yeah. you know, yeah. Yeah. nicer. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know, and, and listen, you know, I've been to China and Japan. I need to go back at some particular point. And, you know, yeah, there are issues, but the issues are no more severe than the issues that we have here. You know, I mean, there was a period during the pandemic where uh, Africans were, uh, you know, being, you know, kind of like put out of some of their apartments or some stuff like that. And I don't know exactly what that was. You know, and I know a couple of uh, brothers who, uh, you know, work in China, they teach in China or whatever else it is. But just as I was saying, in terms of this film, 76 Days, you know, they were able in, you know, a little more than two months, go ahead, lock everything down, do what they had to do, and now they're, for the most part, rid of that. The, the different cultural sensibilities, man, you know. Very yeah, much we, so. We're just slow. But here's, the, here's okay, a couple of No things. honor. You know, my, no, no. You know, now now the United States still about, yeah, we want to give the this this uh, the, the 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 uh, whatever they they're doing this thing to the world. You know yeah. what I mean? Like nobody else has a, has a, a flu. As, 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 uh, um, yeah. what do you call Everybody, that? listen. You know, the Chinese that, got something. The Cubans got, got something. something. You know, all these folks got something. Yeah. But again, it's the idea that these you know racist devils believe that they control everything. Not only control, but whatever they do is going to be better than what anybody else yeah. is doing. You know, late and everything that's and everything. why early on in terms of the testing mm. they didn't take the tests from the WHO and their initial test didn't work even if, even if, even you, you know, still on YouTube I, I, that's all right. yeah it's on it's uh, on yeah <laughs> the, 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 you know that's so interesting you know oh man I don't want to get into Bill Gates or whatever have you but that's you know all, all these people I don't the, trust the, Bill the, Gates. the people okay, you can't the, trust the people you that, that you know, who's behind all this stuff? I mean, Bill Gates' own business has given so much money to this media organization and whatever, and this funding that or that school, and they give so much to, to, to the who or whoever that they, they're giving the money to. Then they're not going to report on each other. It's like a cycle, and you don't know who's the, who's the puppet master behind uh, that. Listen, man, you know that uh, who's the puppet, you know. It's so like it's, Jeffrey Epstein, man. You know, yeah, he's yeah. going ahead and they're letting him do all different kinds of stuff, man. And again, with Bill Gates. You know, uh, he may have gone back to school after he was in Microsoft, but other than that, he just has a high school diploma. My thing is, I don't care what kind of diploma he got. He ain't no scientist. I'm just saying, period. He only has a high school diploma, which means... There was this picture of Bill and Melinda Gates, you know, together. He may have gone back to school. It's possible. But 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 he's still not a scientist. That's what I'm trying to say. But, But you know, money talk. There was this picture of of Bill and Melinda Gates, you know, both there like that, like that. And I'm looking, I said, would you buy anything for these people? Would you trust these people for anything? Oh, it's a mess. It's a mess. Yeah, you know, it, it's just like Microsoft and Microsoft products, man. I try to stay from my, away from Microsoft products whenever I can. It's very difficult to stay away from them, but, you know. But use what you can. Like I said, like I said, you know, my YouTube, you know what I mean? If YouTube, they do all that stuff, they don't affect me at all. In fact, they said, well, you don't have a lot of views. That's right. I don't want a lot of just uh, what, when YouTube first came on, it was for it was for archiving. So I'm an archivist. This is my tool. I don't need an archivist means it could be there for millions of years. And now I said, okay, YouTube gonna be now what happens, there's a thing called BitChute. When I have when my stuff goes up on YouTube, so it's gonna be YouTube, BitChute takes it automatically. So I'm archiving two different sources. Okay. So even if YouTube goes down, I just go, okay, fine. In fact, I think I get more people on BitChute listening to this than YouTube, which is fine. They can't, they can't algorithm me. I'm so, I'm not a, a nobody to them. I'm so below the radar. I'm like, you know, I'm, I'm well, under the under the terrain. You know, we got to do some more stuff with the technology, but it, it's good. I mean, this is to an extent democratizing certain things because as the technology gets cheaper and more in people's hands. It means that you can do more and more things, you know. So we just have to see how we can maximize that and make it something that we can use for our people, our struggles, you know, so that we can literally do that. Look, it has to be a mechanic. Look, uh, you know me, sir. So what happens is I got an I got an answer for everything. It may not be the answer, but I have an answer. I can end racism. I know how to do that. You know what I mean? 
I know how to do jujitsu. Anything you got, I can do it. Why do audio drama? Why? Because it's a narrative. All I have to do is pe get people to talk their narrative into an audio drama setting, and then it's out there. Then you work on it. And then the way I got it, really, is that you don't even wed it to that one thing. You can you can do with it just like any program. You can have your serialization. You can have your spinoffs or whatever have you. You know. And the funny thing is, I'm through. I'm through. I don't write no proposals anymore. I don't do any of that. You want me to do something? I'm not showing no bona fides. I'm on the internet. You want to know what I do? Just go look. Put my name there. You're fine. I got you. I'll come to your space and I'll do the thing. <laughs> you know. And then when I'm done with the thing, you'll see. In fact, you don't have to pay me. I'll do like the old, old game. I'm going to do the thing, right? At the end, you pay me what you think. Mm. If this was worth to you. Okay. I mean, but then again, you know, we're, we're at the point where, we, you know, that, well, I'm a, a sort of weird kind of thing, you know, because I got friends who got, you know, I, I can crash because I'm very low. I don't have any, that kind of responsibility. So, so. Oh, another total note. How's uh, Dr. James Conyers doing? Oh, man. But it was good for him, I guess. Now we shouldn't. But, but, but he's he's retiring. Okay, good, excellent. Oh yeah, that's, that's a what good I thing. Say. I'm man. trying to get him to do. It. <laughs> that's a good thing, man. Oh man, and I got another. I got another slick way to get him to research the stuff. Now, I've been since you know how a lot of people don't want to be on camera, right? So because this house is so, this, you know, probably so interesting. I put it on something. I said, well, tell me about the, this. And he's talking off camera, you know, just like you know, Black Power mixtape. When they really show the stuff, and then the, you don't really hear the, the you know the person's voice or whatever mm -hmm. have you. But the person is not. It's not important. This whole again, the documentary. It's not a, in fact. Um, um, Sam Pollard, the uh, the um, M M M M M M MLK FBI. That film. You see that yet? I documentary. So. Oh man, it's so good. It's so good. But well, he does the same thing. You know, you don't show the people, you, you show the archival footage and whatever have you. So you engage in another level, right? And then, you know, because you, you just see a person one time, just going back and forth like 60 minutes, just looking at a person, somebody move their lips, that means nothing. You know what I mean? Show us something. Yeah. You see? That's the that's the whole point. Oh, you got to see this movie, man. Uh, it's a documentary. It's just out. It'll be a, look, it says MLK, um, like, slash FBI. And it's about the FBI, how they, you know, the whole thing. It's really very, very good. It's very good. Cointel Pro, you know. Cointel yeah, Pro. Thing. Cointel Talk Pro lives. Thing, you know? So we don't, we ain't hit some good movies. This is good. This is good. Okay. You know, I'll see what happens. Uh, one more thing about, uh, about uh, to show you how they, they twist everything up. Uh, Messiah, Judas, Judas and, the, and the Black Messiah. Come on. They knew what they were doing. They're going to pit. Uh, those two brothers against the, in, in, in the um, in the supporting actor uh, thing. Yeah. That is wrong because what happens is the Judas character, the Keith Stem, that's the uh, that's that is the the main actor. Everybody else is it's 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 they're all supporting. Yeah. He is the the, the and since Judas and the Black Messiah. But the interesting thing is, I think they did that because they know that Chadwick Boseman is going to win. Oh, that's how right, they want him. However, that's the, that's the kind of games they play. Yeah. I, so, because I, I, I knew that, I thought that's what happened with the Golden Globes, for sure. Mm -hmm. Because uh, Lakeith Stanfield wasn't uh, at that particular point. He wasn't nominated. Only Daniel uh, Kaluuya was. Really? I didn't know that. Yeah. For, I don't what? Think, for, for Golden Globes. For, for Juice and Black Messiah? They didn't yeah. even look at... So, and anyway, they had Best Actor... And it was Chadwick Boseman and the rest of the people that they had, right? Oh, then for supporting actor, uh, they had Daniel Kaluuya there. And again, it's a question because... Oh, man, this is... Damn, you know, this, this it's... Is so messed up. Yeah. They, they know what they're doing. That's what I'm trying to say. They, they, they're they, giving... They're going to give Chadwick Boseman a posthumous Oscar for Ma Rainey. He, 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 he did a very good job in Ma Rainey. He mean, transformed the part. Man, yeah. For me, but, because it, it was a different sense in terms of the physicality because I saw, um, what is his name, man? You know, the heavyset brother who used to be in, uh, even had a, a, was that a sitcom or whatever else it is for a while? What is the guy's name, man? You know, actor, he, he, he was in a lot of... Um, a Wendell Pierce? No, 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 no. No, I no, said sitcom, I don't know. Uh... What was the brother's name? Man? It'll come to me. But anyway, he's shorter, 
the more heavy set and gives the the, the the whole part a different feeling. What film is this? No, it wasn't even the film. Oh. He did uh, he did on Broadway. He did Ma Rainey. Oh, and he oh, did oh, piano oh, lesson also. Oh yeah, yeah, I know. Oh, what's about, his oh, name? oh, I know you talking about rock, rock, rock. Rock. Yeah. Um, um, rock. I know, I, I, yeah. I know you talking about. No, yeah. but you know, look, even in that thing, it's a, it's a shame because you know, now remember, I watch films, and I don't look at it as well. I look at you doing a job. They can give it to Chadwick Boseman, but the best actor that I've seen is that Mank. I didn't uh, see uh, Mank. Well, what's his name? Um, who did Mank? Uh, I didn't uh, see Mank. Uh, 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 Anyway, he did make monster job, and you talk about and let, let's t- just talk about ensemble cast. Now, Ma Rainey should have ensemble cast, but if they go up against if they go up against uh, 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 Charles Chicago Seven, I'm sorry, that film is much. It's an amazing film. So you can't you this whole just the whole film. Look, it should, maybe nobody should have winners anymore. Just just everybody get nominated. Because the, 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 the everybody nom- an award. <laughs> so just, just everybody's nominated. That's it. There are no best nothing. Why? Because it's so political now. Yeah. It is so, you know. And it's gotten more politicized, quite know, obviously. Oh, we got to give black people something now. Oh, yeah, 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 okay. In fact, that's what the Ma Rainey thing is about. They, they put, they put. Oh, fact, look. They put, they have, uh, what's the name? Ma Rainey, right? It's an ensemble piece. Even though her name is that, but it's about the it's about the song. Yeah. It's not yeah, about yeah, Ma Rainey's yeah. Black Bottom. It has to do something else. It has to do with yeah. with the existence of the South thing and the North thing. Viola, Viola Davis but, is good. She's always good. She's yeah, a fantastic but actress. She did not. As far as what she had to do, as far with what what um, uh, uh, the sister Audra uh, uh, Day had to do in um, in uh, United, Vers- United States versus. Um, uh, Billy Holiday, shoot, give her the award. That's it. She worked. She, worked. she acted her behind off, and she's not even an actress. Yeah, yeah, no, she did good. She did the talk about everybody talking about do the work, do the work. She did the work. The stuff she had to do and singing the songs herself. Yeah. Oh man, that's it. Yeah. Shucks. You know what's on now? Uh, Rita Franklin and with Cynthia Erivo. No, Cynthia man, Erivo can sing, man. Of course, she's a she's Tony Award, or whatever. Have you? She can sing. What, I ain't still watching it, right? I'm waiting for what's the name to come out. You, you, you out watching yet? for for the other one, the movie? Yeah, the movie. Yeah. No, we're gonna see this. Uh, you know, we, we, we're that? watching the it. Anyway. Out now. Is it out yet? No, the movie. I don't think the movie's out yet. But the the series on uh, National Geographic started I can yesterday. It. So I can miss it. I, I but she's it. doing good, man. She's I'm doing so, good. I'm so happy. But she, but she, again, it's one of those people that come here and piss on black people. You know, and take out icon, but, but I don't like what's happening now. All these people well, are I don't doing. I know if they're pissing on black people. No, when I say they're pissing on, she does. She does Twitter things or whatever they have you, and all the rest of the stuff. No, no, and she then, said then, some shit. Yeah, she and then, said some and, shit. Then that's and, a whole other thing. And then but the, you know, my thing is, you're talking about doing the work. Daniel Kaluuya, he did the work. Yeah, but here's the problem. Yes, he did the work. I'm not going to argue that. He did the work, he, and she the, did. She's doing the work in regards to the Rita piece. And here's the problem. Here is the problem. When they have to go out and start talking about stuff, how deep can he really talk about Fred Hampton? He's learning. Just that's as people of that generation are that's learning. A, because, you know, Shaka King can talk about it because... That's my point. He made a specific issue in regards to that. Yes, now, sir. I know his mother... Um, as a matter of fact, I was looking for a number. I couldn't find it or whatever. Uh, no, his mother's uh, Judy Shepard King. Maybe I'll call uh, Craig and find out or whatever, but, uh, you know, because I want to do a program on that. Uh, I'll probably have Mae Jackson, who we started talking about in a little while, uh, Fred Hampton Jr. Now, that's, that's the one good thing. At least he got out there. That, 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 in other words, normally that wouldn't happen. But he, I guess because of well, Zoom. Well, Chairman Fred, of you know, Chairman Fred, you know, he, I met him in New York years ago, mm-hmm. you know. And it was like, wow, you know, he's somewhat like his father, you know, for sure, or whatever else it is, trying to do what he had to do, or whatever else it is. Uh, you know, not, not, not bad, you know. Seemed like a, you know, somebody really who's okay. Really good. I still have my thing, man. I mean, unless you have evolved, if you're still talking about not him, but if you talk, talk about boycotts and 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 and, and picking or whatever have you, I'm gonna like, 
I'm sorry, man. You can, you can do that, but you better be doing some other stuff. Oh, yeah. You know? Yeah. You know, the boycott is a powerful tool, but you good. understand it's only a tool. And it's only one tool in the tool shed. And it can be co-opted like everything. As long as you put, when you put something new out, that's what they can't deal with. Then they got to get a new playbook for that. Yeah. And they're, they're, they're not as fast as that. Yeah. Well, you know. Um, well, within a year, the economy's going to collapse anyway. So what the heck? Well, we got to see what's going to happen. You know, they can probably pop it up some more. Okay, I'm going to stop this right here. I don't know what we got. But it's all going up. Doesn't matter. <laughs> like I said, this is for, I do all kinds of stuff. This is my this is my task. You know what I mean? And here's so funny because a lot of people I'm laughing. They, they, people they, so we just no, talking. No, I, no, I don't want to. I don't want to be just kicking. I don't want to be the, No, you understand me. You got some wealth of knowledge. You know what I mean? Kicking it live. You're a library like everybody else. We not. This is not production value. This is not for your Hollywood thing. We're not gonna cut snippets. No, no. Kicking it live. Kicking it live. Kicking it live. Okay, Monsieur, I don't know what else you want to do today. 